Welcome everybody, Dave and Jess here from Euro Tour, guys. With our coach trip still on hold, it's very important we keep enjoying these positive places. Where are we today, Jess? Today we are at the Los Calinos Golf Course, which also has a wonderful walking trail. Come on, let's take you on our route. So once you arrive onto the golf course, follow the signs for the clubhouse and the restaurants. Park up on the car parks to the left and then follow the path. You can see Dave between the two flags down past the sports centre to the start of the walk. Along the route, there's quite a few handily placed benches to take a rest. And what are the routes we're really enjoying so far? There are two different routes, both circular. The first one's a three kilometre one, and then you can choose to extend that into a five kilometre route. And you bring your bicycle or you can do it on foot and dogs are allowed as long as you keep them on the leash. Come on, Jess, we'd better get going. Even I can follow this route, folks, with these superb signs. Let's head down on the trail, as you can see. Good footwear is required for this trail. But with its distances, I'm sure it's something a lot of you can enjoy in these beautiful surroundings. Let's go. So, Jess, not a huge variety of uh, vegetation, but an awful lot of it. Yes, we've got the pine trees. So if you have got your dog, be careful of those obsessionary caterpillars. And the whole route is lined with the beautiful smell of rosemary. Jess and I both met in Austria, in the Alps, and in, in surroundings like this. So it's so beautiful that we've got it on our doorstep with a short drive. So get yourselves down, follow these routes, be surrounded by all this beautiful nature, find a bench, and you too can be in the Alps, right here in the heart of the Costa Blanca. So here we are in the deep pine forest of the Costa Blanca, where we find the native snake. This one could possibly grow to over five metres in length. Luckily today, it's a little tiddler. Take care folks, this is where the trail splits and you can either extend it to the five kilometre or keep it nice and short at the three kilometre one. We hope you enjoyed visiting this week's Positive Place as much as we have. Remember folks, keep strong, stay positive and we love hearing from you so keep in touch and we look forward to sharing a new place with you next week. Bye for now. Bye for now.